in this video we have given that p square plus 4 q square plus 16 r square is equal to 48 and p q plus 4 q r plus 2 r p is equal to 24 then p square plus q square plus r square is equal to what so we have p square plus 4 q square plus 16 r square is equal to 48 and 48 it is 2 times 24 so p square plus 4 q square plus 16 r square it is equal to 2 times and from here 24 it is pq plus 4 qr plus 2 rp 24 is pq plus 4 qr plus 2 rp and p square plus 4 q square plus 16 r square it is equal to 2 pq plus 8 q r plus 4 r p so p square plus 4 q square plus 16 r square minus 2 p q minus 8 q r minus 4 r p it will be equal to 0 and it is p square plus and 4 q square it is 2 q square plus 16 r square it is 4 r square minus 2 p q it is p times 2 q minus 8 q r it is 2 q times 4 r minus 4 r p it is 4 r times p it is equal to 0 and now if we take p is equal to a 2 q is equal to b and 4 r is equal to c then it is a square plus b square plus c square minus a b minus b c minus c a is equal to 0 so 2 a square plus 2 b square plus 2 c square minus 2 a b minus 2 b c minus 2 c a it will be equal to 2 times 0 and 2 a square it is a square plus a square plus 2 b square it is b square plus b square plus 2 c square it is c square plus c square minus 2 a b minus 2 b c minus 2 c a it is equal to 2 times 0 will be 0 and it is a square plus b square minus 2 a b it is a square plus b square minus 2 a b plus b square plus c square minus 2 b c b square plus c square minus 2 b c plus and c square plus a square minus 2 c a c square plus a square minus 2 c a 
it is equal to zero and it is a minus b s square plus b minus c s square plus c minus a s square is equal to zero and a square of any number x it is greater than equal to zero so a minus b a square it will be greater than equal to zero b minus c a square it will be greater than equal to zero and c minus a a square it will be greater than equal to zero and sum of on the three terms is equal to zero that means a minus b a square it will be equal to zero b minus c a square it will be equal to zero and c minus a a square it will be equal to zero and from here we get a minus b is equal to zero that means a is equal to b from here we get b minus c is equal to zero that means b is equal to c and from here we get c minus a is equal to zero that means c is equal to a so from these three equations we can say that a is equal to b is equal to c so we have a is equal to b is equal to c and a is p it is equal to b is 2q it is equal to c is 4r and we have p square plus 4q square plus 16r square is equal to 48 and it is p square plus 2q square plus 4r square it is 48 and it is p square plus 2q is p a square plus 4r is p a square it is 48 so 3 p a square it is 48 that means p a square it will be 16 and we have to find the value of p a square plus q a square plus r a square so it is equal to p a square plus and we have 2 q is equal to p so q will be equal to p by 2 and q a square it will be equal to p a square by 4 and we have 4 r is equal to p so r will be equal to p by 4 and r a square it will be equal to p a square by 16 so q a square it is p a square by 4 plus r a square it is p a square by 16 and p a square is 16 plus p a square is 16 by 4 plus p a square is 16 by 16 so it is 16 plus 4 plus 1 that will be equal to 21 so it is 21